How come nobody's talking about this? It's literally something straight out of the Matrix, dude. Fucking giant glass Kinder Egg babies being formed in a warehouse factory somewhere. Like some sweatshop. <laughs> some sweatshop factory baby being made. How come Kersher or fucking Pipkin Pipper or even my like Midas, they love this conspiracy theory shit, but this is literally right in front of our eyes. Introducing Ectolife, the world's first artificial womb facility, powered entirely by renewable energy. Ectolife allows infertile couple to conceive a baby and become the true biological parents of their own offspring. As if it wasn't already hard enough for you to get your own true biological offspring, this warehouse where you can get your own Kinder Egg surprise is a true 100% guaranteed stamp of approval biological child. <laughs> what the fuck? It's a perfect solution for women who had their uterus surgically removed due to cancer or other complications. Ah, other complications. So if you're a woman who decided to become a trans man and now you can no longer have children, don't worry, because in the future, <laughs> we got you covered. With Ectolife, premature births and C-sections will be a thing of the past. Ectolife is designed to help countries that are suffering from severe population decline, including Japan, Bulgaria, South Korea, and many others. Now you see, they mentioned Japan with the decline in the birth rates going on, but it's actually not as bad as how they're making it out to be, allegedly. I don't know if that's true or not. Somebody could, could somebody please fact check on that one? I would appreciate that. The artificial intelligence based system also monitors the physical features of your baby and reports any potential genetic abnormalities. Ah, so they're using augmented intelligence aka AI, you know, the very thing that's stealing people's jobs and is allegedly the end of humanity. Well don't worry because we're going to use the thing that's going to be the end of humanity to look after the end, <laughs> to look after humanity. <laughs> is that a red baby? The app also provides you with a high resolution live view of your baby's development. A special section in the app allows you to watch a time lapse of your baby's growth and share it directly with your loved ones. Now, it was one thing where, you know, like when a pregnant woman should go to the to like the doctors, the clinic or whatever, and then put the weird gel, like the jelly glue on her, and then like they have to scan her, and they get like a black and white photo of the baby, and then they could take that home, and be like, oh look, this is the baby. Oh, that's kind of oh wow, life. But the oh, the idea that they're making an app so you can get a live feed of your child growing in this glass Kinder egg for you to just share. Oh, like oh my god, what is going to happen with social media? Babies can recognize language and learn new words while still in the womb. Ectolife growth pods feature future Instagram re reels. <laughs> future Instagram reels are going to be a time-lapse video of your child in an in a glass Kinder egg. Oh my god! Internal speakers that play a wide range of words and music to your baby. Through the app, you can choose the playlist that your baby listens to. Are you worried about your child not knowing the sound of your voice when it's growing inside of a warehouse somewhere on the opposite side of the country? Well don't worry because with this app we can let you play ACDC as loud as you want to your child. Don't worry we won't riddle it with any propaganda or nonsense you know whilst it's you know in its early stages to be brainwashed. You can also directly sing to your baby and make them familiar with your voice before birth. Our goal is to provide you with an intelligent offspring that truly reflects your smart choices. Ectolife improves your bonding experience with your baby, thanks to a 360 degrees camera that's fitted inside the satanic your baby's, baby's growth pod. You can use your virtual reality headset to explore what it's like to be in your baby's place. Wait, hang on a minute. So are you telling me that if I have a headset, I can look through the eyes of my baby in the giant glass kinder egg? Why? This bioreactor also contains a liquid solution that serves as the ambiotic fluid that surrounds babies in the mother's uterus. It's rich of vital hormones, growth factors, and antibodies that sustain your baby's growth and development. 
thanks to a system controlled by artificial intelligence, each baby receives custom nutrients tailored to their needs. The second bioreactor is designed to eliminate any waste products produced by the babies. Hang on a minute, so you're going to have these two giant tanks in the middle of the room. And the only, the only way you can differentiate which one's which is by having one looking like a neon green liquid and then the other one a red liquid? What is it? Fucking Kool-Aid? What are you... What? what? <laughs> the artificial umbilical cord helps the babies to release their waste products into the second bioreactor. With the help of a delicate layer of engineered enzymes, the second bioreactor can then recycle waste products and turn them back into useful nutrients. Hang on a minute. So this that she just said, it, it's not even going to differentiate between the two different tanks. It just said it's going to recycle the baby poop and stuff, whatever it is, right? And it's going to turn it into... Whoa, it's, got, it's, it's recycling the... Oh, your future baby is going to be a shit eater. And if you want your baby to stand out and have a brighter future, our Elite Package offers you the opportunity to genetically engineer the embryo before implanting it into the artificial womb. Are you telling me that we can character customize our babies? <laughs> Thanks to CRISPR-Cas9 gene editing tool, you can edit any trait of your baby through a wide range of over 300 genes. By genetically engineering a set of genes, the Elite Package allows you to customize your baby's eye color, hair color, skin tone, physical strength... This is literally character customization, what the fuck? So if I said that I wanted a 3 foot 2, green, pointy-eared, white-haired child, I could have a baby Grogu? Sign me up! <laughs> You don't have to worry about power cuts or carbon footprint. Ectolife uses highly efficient, clean... Don't worry guys, this is an eco-friendly baby making factory. <laughs> ...renewable energy consisting of solar and wind power. The highly advanced pods operate with minimal energy needs, making it easy for your baby to make it to full term without any complications. It's a good thing that they've got battery saving mode for this. I'll give them that. And for those who want a more convenient solution, Ectolife is made accessible so your life can be easier. Thanks to our miniaturized bioreactors and long-lasting batteries, you can use Ectolife growth pods at the comfort of your home, allowing you to incubate your baby in your building without the need to visit our factory. So if you didn't trust the factory, if you wanted to take your baby home with you, they got you covered, man. They got a portable version of this Kinder Egg. I've been calling it a Kinder Egg. Like, there's literally nothing else to describe it. It's just a Kinder Egg. It's a pod. It's a glass fucking... It's a glass fucking... You know them little... You know them toys? Do you remember the toys back in, like, the early 2000s, the late, nine, the late 90s, where it was like, you get this little egg-shaped thing, and then you'd... It would, you'd get like, this little egg-shaped thing, and inside would be an alien in goo, and it'd be like a sticky alien. Do you remember those? This is basically that, but with actual... Humans. <laughs> what the fuck? Worry no more, because Ectolife got you covered. Ectolife. Reinventing evolution. This is something that's happening in 49 years time. They said 50, but it's already been a year since this came out. And no, I don't, I, I've not seen any VTubers talk about this, any conspiracy people. I've not seen Elon Musk retweet it on fucking Twitter, right? So in 49 years time, we're going to have a Toba gooey alien egg either at home or in a factory where you can have a fully customizable chi uh, child, no, actually not even a child, like for me, like it's, for me, it's going to be a grandchild or a great grandchild. My great grandchild is going to be some idiot's character customization from like an Ark Survival game or a fucking Elden Ring. Like, have you seen those <laughs> fucking meme creations? That's the future, okay? That's, <laughs> oh god, humanity. We, we, we are the end of humanity, not AI, it's us. It's humanity itself being the end of humanity. There's no other way to cut it. I have no idea how to end this video either, other than, other than sharing this knowledge and fact for you guys. Like, this is the weird thing that's happening in life. This is the weird thing that's going to happen in the future of our lives, actually. So, <laughs> fucking, I don't know, man. Just, 
let me let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below like the video if you liked it if you dislike it at least at least critique you know give me some critiquing rather than criticism you know help me out and uh yeah <laughs> what the fuck dude <laughs> i'll see you guys in the next video